comes to the fit. Well, I am taking a little dip. Let's see what happens. just so after my lift or in between if I need to come check the charts. Got it right here. All right, let's go get on the treadmill. It's hard. It's hard. Yeah. Yeah. I had 200 for lunch. Last night I fought on a cunt. 24 shows in a month. Look at that time it was crunch. Ice, diamonds is crunch. Louis B, but my t-shirt is tough. Yeah, cold as a slash. Belly wrist on, sipping the test. Go get it, I must. Fuck up good enough, pussy no must. Yeah. Love and I lust. My crew loyal, we trusted in us. Yeah, money need up. Got this shit out the ground in a month. Yeah, look at it, glitz. See what I mean. A lot of be faces, be pink and green. Fuck on her naked. So right now we're in key right now. See if that focuses. That'll focus. We're up a thousand fifty right now. Okay. That was a nice little push there. <clears throat> Obviously, market is not open, but there was an opportunity, so I jumped in. I want to say, what did I jump in? Five contracts on NQ. Yeah. So obviously this is what I'm talking about, going against my rules a little bit. There's good opportunity, we're making higher highs, higher lows, but we gotta be careful with this kind of play. It's 8.54 right now, Eastern Standard. Um, so this is not market open yet. So anything could happen, I could get chopped up in here. It was moving nicely, it came out of a um, consolidation zone. So it's kind of a break of a high. And we've already kind of got a very not quite a retest I would like, but it did retest. It just didn't come all the way back down to the box where it was consolidating out of. So it's very possible that it pulls back down here. But as I start to see higher highs potentially, maybe I get in another move. I have predictions to go to 18,451.75 where it can take, where there's a fair value. At minimum, 18,400. So if I see this thing start to push back up, it's potential play to get back in, but I wanna protect obviously the money we've just made so let's just be smart with it um, and let's just keep moving. Chances are because we're 30 minutes out from market open, we just wait for it to develop, but we'll see. All right, peace. This is by far, as a man, <clears throat> one of the toughest things for me to even admit to and or get on camera about. I'm pissed. Trades this morning went so well, told myself that I was not going to get back in the market. Of course, I continued to look at it. <sighs> Took a couple losses. And I blew it. One day. This is all that it took. So, this is the real. This is legitimately as raw as it gets. I <clears throat> Anyways, um on to the next account. I've got to get it back, obviously. I've got to get my PA back. <laughs> At some point, enough will be enough, and I will stop making the same mistakes. But today is not that day. So, again, should have left it alone. I was at 3.02.5. The 
things I want to say right now that I'm not going to say on camera. And it's all obviously, of course, self-inflicted. Like, why? Why did I even get back in? This, guys, is not what is publicized enough on Instagram, TikTok, your millionaire day traders. I'm Listen, this is me. I'm not even about to sit here and try to rain on somebody else's parade or like start talking about how scam, scammy people are in this industry or whatever, like whatever bro like I'm, I'm owning up to this obviously losing my account shit pisses me off like more than anything but it doesn't change what I have to do as a trader me so <clears throat> I'm not going to sit here and rant I don't want to talk about this too much we're going to move on from it we're going to come to the markets tomorrow with a better attitude you know what I'm saying and that passing phase that I told you 3 to 320 I have to do that over again wow anyways I thought I was done I was actually I had the SD card already in my computer I was getting ready to upload and of course I sit down in front of these two monitors and just feel like there's a trade that needs to be had and that's what I fucking get that's what I get so don't overtrade, kids. Fuck. See you guys tomorrow. Peace.